or welcome back to my channel my name is Haley. if you're new here if you are please 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 subscribe down below and hit the bell as well that way you don't miss any of my future videos we have a tight schedule for today so i'm gonna go ahead and get going and kind of explain what we're doing today on the go so right now i am heading to chick-fil-a to grab something for breakfast and then after that i'm gonna be looking at some different used clothes stores consignment stores i've done a video like this before with having like a budget and i'm gonna have the same 20 dollars budget but the goal this time is to find a festive outfit potentially like a cute christmasy outfit or cute new year's outfit either one i'm open to we're gonna hope this time it's not a flop like the last time i'm gonna be going to first clothes mentor and then plato's closet and if we don't find anything within those two stores we'll just have to consider it a flop I got my Chick-fil-A, ended up ordering some chicken minis and a lemonade, and obviously comes with a lovely hash brown. I'm going to close mentor. My expectations are like six out of 10 for that. Like I'm hoping I can find something there, but if I don't, I have more higher expectations for Play-Doh. You will see. And even if we find something else totally not festive, but I still like it, I still would consider that a win. I think if we go in with the prompt, you tend to come out with better results. It looks like there's nobody in the parking lot close to close mentor, so that should be a positive sign that we can like quickly kind of browse, peruse, figure out what we need, get in, get out. At least that's how I'm taking it. Let's head on in. was not able to find anything in there as you saw they had a little bit of like a holiday dress section and that literally was all the holiday dresses they had throughout the store i even looked at different sweaters other more casual dresses none of those were even impressive really so i'm gonna go ahead and drive to the other store and eat my chick-fil-a in the parking lot then go into play-doh's hopefully we will have more success and selection options actually a lot of spring and summer stuff still in there like they had some sweaters and some long sleeve dresses and things but there was a lot of short sleeve really bright spring summery stuff in there so there wasn't much to pick from but they did have 50% off the clearance. We're gonna hope that Play-Doh's has something like that too going on. I just finished my breakfast so I'm gonna go ahead and head into Play-Doh's now. Again the goal is to get an outfit for $20 or less. Ideally something festive but if that doesn't happen that's fine too and I would like to get some accessories. Every time I go to this Play-Doh's get a great accessory. I have this car while I back in May of 2019 before I went to college and you see it's still in great condition. It was in even better condition when I got it and it was for like $12 like I have always found the best accessories, so I have high hopes in that department, but we're gonna see if we can find great outfits. I've gotten t-shirts from this Play-Dohs, but again, I've never got quality dresses, blouses, those types of stuff. Could be a flop, but we're gonna hope it's not. So let's go ahead and hit it. So that was the utter fail. All I got were these earrings right here. They were $5. They're super cute. Of course, you know, I love pink. I got these. Yeah, that's really all I got because their holiday section, surprisingly, was even worse than clothes mentor. There was nothing in there. And what was in there was very like chinchy and cheap looking and i was like mm, i really don't want to invest in something i know i'm probably not going to wear so hopefully this video was entertaining for you to see me flop once again on this 20 dollars used clothes challenge again i'm going to remind you to subscribe down below and hit the bell if you haven't done so already and until next time i will catch you guys on the flip side bye guys